Hi, and welcome back to Brentech IT Support. Today, this is a subscriber's request on how to set up port forwarding on the ASUS RT-AX88U. It's quite a simple one to do, so it'll be a nice quick video for you guys. What you've got to do first of all is go to a web browser and type in your router's IP address, which hopefully you should know. If not, there is a way to use the ASUS URL, and I'll put that in a link in the description below and that should hopefully work as well for you. You then simply enter your username and password. And click sign in, or press enter. Now I do recommend using the web URL um, GUI rather than using your mobile applet because it's much more intensive. You've got a lot more features in here. Scroll down and come down to the WAN tab and then back up again to virtual server port forwarding. Then if it's the first time you're doing it, that would be set to off. So you need to set that to on. And then you add your first profile by clicking add profile. They've got some basic ones pre-selected and templated for you, so you can add those easily. But I always like doing them manually. So I'll just give it a name. and you select the type of protocol that you want to allow through. In the external port, you can put a comma in to do a port range, which you can't do in internal port, because if I try to put a comma in, it won't let you, so you may have to put multiple ones in. And then you give it your IP address for the machine you want to forward the port to. And then you can just click OK and that will add it. I'm clicking cancel because I don't want to set any more up. If you've got one here and you want to edit it, all that you need to do is come to here and you can click on the edit button and you can just change that and click OK. And that's now automatically made that change. That is now live and running. Whereas when you're doing things such as MAC address binding and Static, setting static IP addresses, you have to restart the router for those changes to take effect because obviously it could be changing what device, what is numbers on. So you've got to restart. But for this, once you've added the profile, that's it. You're good to go. Well, I hope that helps. Nice seeing you all again. Please, if you did like the video, give it a good thumbs up. Like, comment, and subscribe. Always leave a comment down below. Really do appreciate that. But that's it for today. Bye for now.